in our country. This is my This week, the head of America's Environmental Protection Agency became the latest Trump official to face a public confrontation. Scott Pruitt was approached by a woman carrying her young son at a restaurant in Washington, D.C. Kristen Mink criticized the EPA chief for, quote, slashing emission standards for cars and trucks and asked him to step down. We deserve to have somebody at the EPA who actually does protect our environment, somebody who believes in climate change and takes it seriously for the benefit of all of us, including our children. Um, so I would urge you to resign before your scandals push you out. Pruitt didn't respond on the video, but an EPA spokesman said, quote, Pruitt always welcomes input from Americans, whether they agree or disagree with the decisions being made at EPA. The spokesman also said that Pruitt thanked the woman for her comments. Pruitt is fighting fires on more fronts than just public opinion. He's under investigation by a congressional panel for renting a condo tied to an energy lobbyist. He's also been criticized for flying first class and spending money on expensive items for his office, like a soundproof telephone booth. Pruitt's restaurant confrontation makes him the third Trump official to face similar treatment in recent weeks. Department of Homeland Security Secretary Kirsten Nielsen was heckled at another restaurant in the capital city over immigration. And White House spokeswoman Sarah Sanders was asked to leave a restaurant in Virginia. After Pruitt was confronted, Sanders told Fox News that Americans should be able to disagree, but not in a way that keeps officials from stepping foot in public.